What's up YouTube? It's T Dog again with another video. Uh, this video is just gonna be a quick video of a uh, you know mod update slash plans for the near future. So I mean I've been getting a lot of like uh, questions like on comments and my Instagram about my mods. Well, first and foremost, she's wrapped. 3M wrap and the light gloss ivory. I bought the material, but a friend helped me uh, wrap it. He's wrapped cars and all this other stuff before, so this is this was his first bike. But you know, we wrapped it. Took uh, several weeks because it was hard to synchronize our schedule and whatnot. <laughs> uh, that was the first big, you know, mod I did to her. Uh, the, the second big mod, which I, and if you ask me, is a uh, the real big mod, I guess you could say, would be that Dan Moto exhaust that I, y'all already know about those. I I just before this video, there's several videos of this exhaust already. I did a uh, install video of these mirrors and grips, but these are not the same grips. Those were built well grips off you know Amazon. They were good grips, but the thing is, when I put on these bar ends and took off the uh, factory uh, bar end weights, there's a little bit more felt vibration in these handlebars, and those built wells they weren't helping to absorb that. And you know, just from researching and whatnot, apparently these gel like pro grips are really really good at absorbing uh, vibration i still feel it in my hands a little bit uh, especially after like a while of riding like an, over an hour or so but it's a lot better than they were these bar ends i got them off amazon or wait amazon or ebay one of those two i can't remember i'll have to look back uh, they're okay um they work well for what they are but because of the vibration at high speeds it shakes the mirrors you know a lot oh, and <laughs> I know I said this a while back but I have I still have yet to do it I'm gonna put uh, silicone all up in here I might even try and take out the mirror too uh, and put silicone under it and stick it back on it's supposed to help with the uh, vibration uh, through into the mirror itself side license plate that's one of the first mods I did uh, side license plate holder I do have LED uh, uh, mounting screws to light it up because it's you know legal that way uh, I still haven't put them on. Uh, a friend of mine is gonna help me wire it once I get like a little bit extra like stereo wire onto the. Well, while we're here, my uh, Fender Delete mod. I keep this. The this is the mod I keep getting uh, questions on, uh, new like numerous times on on Instagram and on YouTube. They call it a light bar on the website, but it's really more of a light strip, LED light strip, on CustomDynamics.com. I'll link it in the description. It is a tail light slash brake light with integrated turn signals. This particular one comes in three different uh, lengths. The one I got for the Vulcan S is it's like nine inches or something like that, nine point something or whatever. But that's more or less the size you want. The other one's a little too short. The other one's a little too long. I think that's all in terms of like what I've done. But onto things that, that I'm going to be doing in the near future to it. I'm going to add a few things. To the aesthetics of the bike really a few things off ebay i want to get i'll uh, reveal them when i get them i think in a different video i said i got another mod that's supposed to complement this exhaust it's still not here yet because it's from it's coming in from uh, europe but it has arrived in america so hopefully in the next you know week maybe it'll arrive it's already been almost a month but is it it is an air filter from the company dna dna racing or something like that they make car parts motorcycle parts uh good good company good a uh, good brand from what i gather but yeah i'm getting that then i'll be getting eventually a power commander 5 or a booster plug i was told booster plugs are a good alternative to power commander 5s if you don't want to pay power power commander 5 prices and uh, they're a little bit more simpler in terms of what you can do uh, in mapping and stuff but it may just be all i need i do plan on changing out this bulb with an led bulb of some kind and then changing these out with a led turn signals of some kind oh what i'll probably do in the near future is get lower profile handlebars i've already explained it in another video why i wanted lower, pro lower profile handlebars but hopefully in the next uh you know couple weeks or so i'll get i'll order me one i might have to actually get new bar ends matter of fact if i do do that because the one i'm looking at is hollow these actually do come with these sleeves four hollow bars but uh i think i threw those away or lost them i might have to get new uh bar ends <laughs> but i already have an idea of what kind of bar in uh mirrors i want to get so no worries on that i do want to get an aftermarket seat one day uh it's not on the top of my priority list or anything but you know i want to get a more comfortable better looking seat oh and uh preferably one that has an integrated like passenger seat not really for passengers 
but because I I wanted to coincide with another mod that I want to do, which is a sissy bar slash stinger style sissy bar, kind of like the Harley guys. Uh, especially the Harley Sportster guys. I'm probably gonna get some flack for that, but honestly, I always liked how they looked, regardless. And no one makes them for this bike, so I figured I'd find a you know a fabricator somewhere in Houston. I was thinking like mounting them to the screws in here, the little mounting plate, and then coming up, not too tall, cause I don't want I don't like them too tall, but like about two or three feet, not that high. Why do I want that? Well, one, I like the looks of that, but two. I kind of want something to tie luggage to because I do plan on doing more touring in the future going to places uh, farther out of, out from Houston and I might need to you know carry a bag or two with me having a backpack strapped to my shoulders the whole time after a while it gets kind of old <laughs> I'm not gonna lie and I mentioned I want a specifically passenger seat integrated seat I want that rather than a luggage type of uh, attachment simply because the passenger style seat, I could still put bags and luggage on it. At the same time, if need to, I can put someone on there. Uh, the luggage seat is really just for bags. You can't, I guess a person can sit on it, but it won't be comfortable. It, I just feel like the passenger seat specifically would be more functional. Oh, I do want to add LED lights, like glow lights. Not really sold on like what color I want. At first I was thinking white, but then I was thinking, you know what, yellow might actually look, look good. But then again, most of those kits come uh, where you could change the light whenever you want so eh, you know whatever I was thinking like around the frame up here on both sides and then somewhere down here I don't know we'll see I'll figure it out well that's about it on the mods I've done and what I plan on doing I'm, a, I'm on my way home actually like I haven't rode in the past couple of days so I decided to go out for a little bit but let us go home and make some noise on the way I need to get some gas too Ooh, baby I love it. It's kind of a douche thing to do, but man, I can't help it. But love to, I get, I just can't help it. When I used to have my Tundra and a couple other cars I used to have, I had aftermarket exhaust on then, and I do the same thing. I just, I love hearing the, the exhaust echo. <laughs> hey. Stuff. Tomorrow is Good Friday, by the way, at the time of this video that I'm making, so giving you a time reference. <laughs> ah, I love it. Let's go disturb a little bit of peace. I mean, well, there's bars and, and pubs here this, on this down here, so I mean, like what piece? I'll do it for this video. It's a quick uh, mod update and, and uh, a little bit of plans and whatnot. But anyways, yeah, please like and subscribe, comment, share, all that good stuff if you like. And uh, I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace.